Hey everybody, it's Mike with Presentation Plus Ups back with another tip in my PowerPoint Boss series. In today's episode, I'll show you three ways to navigate to any slide you want when you're in PowerPoint slideshow mode without backing out of your presentation and showing off the gory details of your desktop. Uh, believe me, nobody wants to see that. I've personally used each of these tips in both live and virtual meetings, and I'm 100% confident you're gonna love these PowerPoint boss tips, so stick around. By the way, if you're new to the show, I encourage you to check out my broader Presentation Plus Ups YouTube channel. I've got over 30 videos and several playlists related to virtual office setup, next level Zoom and Teams broadcast presentation capability, PowerPoint presentation design, virtual office setup, and also presenter tips and tricks. And it's all there free to you at zero cost. And if you'd like some one-on-one -on -one consulting, you can reach me at michael at flowstrategic.com. Thank you very much. Now back to the show. Tip number one, the slide punch enter method. For tip one, we're kicking it old school. Here's what you'll need. A notepad, a pen, a slide number. What? <laughs> yep, this is just the best. Okay, so you've got a big long presentation. What I want you to do is write down key slide numbers for various sections. For this presentation, let's say it's slide, okay, slide four, our agenda, slide 32, we have our detailed pitch, and let's just say slide 48, next steps. Simple, simple, simple. While in slideshow mode, and as long as your slideshow is the active monitor, that is, you haven't been mousing over and looking at email or surfing a browser in another window, I want you to use your keyboard and type the slide number and then hit the enter key. Okay, to illustrate the point here, I've got my key slides, I've got my keypad, and my slide deck is the active monitor. And you can see I've got my mouse hovering on it, so I've made that the active monitor. I'm not looking at emails or anything like that. So let's hit slide four and then hit the enter key and you'll see we go to slide four. Slide 32 is our detailed information and slide 48 is next steps. Hopefully you got it, pretty simple. Love this one, slide punch, enter. And you know, just think of me when you've got your crumpled up little notepad in front of you. Okay, the second way I'll show you how to hyperport to any slide you want is to use the See All Slides navigational tool built into PowerPoint's presentation mode console. Okay, for those of you that are unfamiliar with presenter mode, let me just explain this real quick. From the home menu, and you can see I'm right here in my PowerPoint. From the home menu, go over to slideshow. This is a very handy panel. And under the monitors column, what I want you to do is first select presenter view. And that will give you the ability when you go into slideshow mode, which you can do from the bottom right, to have your one of your monitors at least turn into a destination panel where you can control a lot of cool things. Um, I'm going to back out of that for a second because the other part of that equation is you have a little monitor selection above that and you want to make sure that you've selected the right monitor that you want your slideshow, the actual slideshow itself to project to. And it might take a little practice. So for example, I'm going to go to my back screen here and you can see that I've got a lot of different monitors. What I want you to do is make sure that you've selected the right monitor that you want for your presentation. So you're gonna see right here, this section is going to turn into my presenter mode control panel. And this monitor will go into my actual slide deck. Okay, so that's a little bit of practice. You're gonna to wanna to make sure if you wanna be a PowerPoint boss, that you've selected the right monitor. So if you have three monitors, four monitors, five monitors, it's a free country. You can do what you want. Just make sure that you've selected the right monitor so that way when you're ready for your presentation, you glide into it effortlessly. Okay, cool. So we've done that. Let me just do that one more time here. I'm gonna go right down here. I'm gonna select the slideshow button and you can see we are in presenter mode. Now let's go to that much vaunted show all slides feature. You're gonna notice that on the bottom below the slides, you've got a very cool panel. There's a lot of cool videos that we can shoot about presenter mode here. But the one I want you to see is to the left of the pen is that vaunted see all slides. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna click that and you can notice that on your presenter panel, we have a hidden access to all the slides. And by the way, if you have created sections, which I can talk about in another video, you will nicely 
navigate to those various different sections, okay? So I'm gonna go back into my gory little back cam and show you how this works. So let's say we wanna to go to slide eight, we click it, and you can see it immediately goes to slide eight over on your slideshow. Okay, if I go back in to show all slides, we wanna to go to slide 41, we click it and we go right there. So handy little feature, I think this is a great one. It is something that if you're using presenter mode, it is a great, great feature. I don't always use presenter mode, so that brings me to our tip number three. Tip number three, see all slides the unhidden way. For tip three, we're going to access see all slides right from your slideshow view. Here's how. Okay, from your active slideshow monitor, you've got it in slideshow view. Whether or not you're using presenter mode or not, it doesn't matter but I want you to hover your mouse on the bottom left of your slideshow. From there, you'll see several icons. You will see the previous slide, the next slide, the pen tool, which I've talked about in another video, by the way, and yes, see all slides. I'm gonna click that, and now you have that ability to nicely navigate to any slide you want. And again, if you've thought very carefully about the naming of these sections, you can go ahead and use this really as a de facto navigation tool in a presentation. Okay, let me show you another way to access the see all slides without even touching a keypad. So if you hold down the control key on your keyboard, probably the command key on a Mac, not 100% sure on that one, don't judge me. But while holding down the control key, if you hover your mouse over that slideshow and then use the wheel mouse, that's this little thing. So hold down control and then go from top to bottom like that. Okay, so if you hover and hold the control key down while using that wheel mouse trick I just showed you, voila, you will bring up all the slides in your deck. And as you can see, you've got that handy dandy little section area. If you've thoughtfully named your sections, you can actually turn see all slides into a nicely indexed presentation tool. Just don't name a section something like gym slides or ask for the sale here if you're planning to use the see all slides method for tip three. Okay, that's enough PowerPoint boss moves for one session. By now you have three ways to navigate to any slide in your deck with supreme confidence. To recap, the old school slide punch enter method, presenter modes see all slides method, and slideshows see all slides method. And that's what makes you a PowerPoint boss. For Sirius, on behalf of everyone at the Presentation Plus Ups YouTube channel, and right now, admittedly, that's just me, thank you for tuning in. Please spread the word, and most of all, make it a great day.